African Art Gallery Arusha, Tanzania. Welcome to an unbelievable experience of cultural heritage. So we have just arrived at African Art Gallery Center. It's along Sokoine Road and approximately 10 minutes away from the city center. This place is known to be the largest art gallery in Africa with arguably the biggest collection of African art. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Becky Wanyonyi and today I'm coming to you from Arusha, Tanzania and currently I'm at the Arusha Cultural Heritage Center. I just want to go and see what they have to offer. We explore and learn more about the culture of Arusha. So come with me. We are just getting into the entrance. This is the entrance. Cultural heritage. Welcome. Dr. Jane Goodball to Arusha. Ooh. Wow. Very beautiful. You will notice an artful display of antiques and sculptures and paintings right mm. from the entrance. This place will leave you jaw dropping. I can see the arts and culture and sculptures around here. Very artistic. I love, love, love. So the Cultural Heritage Center was established in the year 1994 and it's the first of its kind in Africa dedicated towards exploring the rich treasures derived from the African culture. So I understand that this place has a huge collection of art from all over Africa. That is Ghana, Mali, Ivory Coast, Congo, Nigeria. How do you go? It has different kind of art from weapons to animal hides and skins and um, it has um, furniture, utensils, woodcrafts, antique doors, paintings, photography and just a lot. And then you'll also find uh, different shops for souvenirs. The place also has a restaurant, uh, a coffee shop, a spice center, a bead center, and a flea shop, which has a variety of artifacts at different prices. So this place houses different antique shops, so you can definitely get a very good souvenir that has an African touch. If you happen to be in this center, feel free to shop for your gifts, your antiques, uh, from the shops. So I do understand that the proceeds from this uh, gallery go to the conservation of elephants in Africa and the main concept of this is anti-poaching clearly defined by the sculpture of the large unique beaded elephant. Mm. Oh this is a cultural village demo. demo. Masai, Mazare and Mwarusha. This is how the cultural villages look like. This is a demo of a cultural village. So we are proceeding on to the main building which houses the art gallery and the museum. And one thing noteworthy is that this building has a very interesting architecture which is symbolic i'll take you through that in a minute wow loving the architecture and the sculpting in this place one of the largest art gallery in africa 
so beautiful. This is one of the landmarks around Arusha. Blue stones, custom made jewelry. So this place has a reputation of having the finest Tanzanite stones which are also found in the Merirani hills of Tanzania and they are the best in the world. Look at this. So nice. This is the shield that is captured when you take a picture from outside. This is definitely a must visit if you're coming here. Also loving the architecture of this building. Very architectural. So many restaurants and places to eat. Family tree Ujama. A traditional type of sculpture carved by legendary Kavanona Sebastian. Ah. Family tree Uzama. You all know that Tanzania is well known for the concept of Ujama and African socialism. Let's check out on that. Also sculptures and paintings. So beautiful. You're not supposed to to use video and cameras inside the gallery. It's prohibited, but that's the entrance to the cultural heritage gallery. But we're not allowed to use cameras inside. But this place is so beautiful. I'll be heading in there in a few but I will not be able to use my to record anything there so this I understand this is one of the largest galleries in Africa look at that look at that very beautiful paintings It's definitely a must visit. I'm loving. So the exterior of the gallery um, has a drum, a shield, and a spear, which are all major African symbols. Welcome to African Art Gallery, Arusha, Tanzania. So if you're an art lover, this is a must visit for you and it also has very great backdrops to take pictures. Ah, that, that monument depicts the vibrant culture of Africans, women dancing and they are wearing very artistic attire. Yeah. So uh, this sculpture depicts slave trade and it also just shows the collaboration that was happening between the Europeans and uh, the Arabs to trade African Africans here. Yeah. Attract devil. Why will someone think of just sculpting a devil? Really now? Really? Weird. The interior has three areas. We have the history, we have the wildlife, and we have the soul. So ethnographic artifacts mm. fill the history area. So just for context, ethnography is the scientific description of people and cultures with their customs, habits, and mutual differences. So the second section is the wildlife area, which consists of contemporary paintings and sculptures of the curvatures roaming the African savanna. And then last but not least, we have the soul area, 
of section which captures Africa's energy, allure, and essence. Look at this. These are more furniture, artifacts. New make of this sculpture. It also depicts the slavery, the African slave trade. Guys, what do you make of this? What do you think this are? <laughs> Very interesting sculpture right there. One way. Oh, one way is a store. It's an African curio store. Mm -hmm. Mask gallery. Hmm? Wait, how's a... So guys, we are on our way out. We have come to the end of our exciting tour in this remarkable art gallery. So guys, please know that this center is located at the heart of Arusha, just 5 or 10 minutes away from the CBD, and entrance is absolutely free. So please do purpose to visit when you're in Arusha. Hey guys, so we have come to the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching. And uh, the highlight of the moment is the art, the culture that is in this place. This center is quite annoying. This is definitely a must visit when you come to Tanzania, Arusha. And I understand that this is one of the largest cultural centers in East Africa. So I really enjoyed my spending time here. And I hope you get to visit this place soon. Thank you so much for watching and stand by for more videos about Arusha Tanzania. Thank you. Bye.